when we got in in August of 1985, we liberalized, we, what is the right word? We came in on two or three planks. We knew then that you cannot succeed in getting the people we wanted to mobilize the Nigerians. They were bright people, they were good, and they could be obedient. So then the country has a lot of uh, resources. So we need to mobilize the people with the resources that the country has and provide the people a leadership towards achieving, making the country a greater country. That is the first thing that came into our mind. How do we do it? Where well, some of the policies we put in place, we wanted full participation of the people. So anything that stifled them, the decrees, for example, that didn't give them the opportunity to talk and say anything. We said, no, we change it. We abrogated that uh, decree. And then control, we had control of the economy, or we ran a controlled economy. We knew that the people wanted to take this in, in their hands. We ran the politics, and we knew that for the country to succeed, you have got to mobilize the people to do it on their own. So those are the things we wanted to see uh, done. And therefore, we came out with a clear vision about the country, mobilizing the country, freeing the economy from government control, allowing the people to talk and say what they wanted to see, allow the people to decide on how they should be. Those are things that came to our mind, and I uh, think I'm glad we did. There are those, of course, who have pointed to the fact that, yes, you did that, but you also kept, for example, Decree 2, which still gave you the authority. But it was not as... Um, as restrictive or as more than Decree 4, is it? Decree 4, yes. Yeah. All the same, the, that decree that you talked about was still there when we allowed the media to, to become publicly owned, so that you could do more about Tokyo. Otherwise, we wouldn't have allowed it to happen. We allowed private ownership of both print and electronic, electronic uh, media. We, now, thank God, you have got uh, the latest one. What is it um, called? Online, social media. Social media. Thank God, the people resisted it. Otherwise, it would have been killed. But the people resisted it. So you think it was good? Or you think it is good, it is, social media? Yeah, it is good. It's still part of opening up, allowing Nigerians to talk and say what they want, allowing Nigerians to do their business, even online and so on and so on.